Hello everyone, welcome back to another video here. We're at the Contemporary and we're doing the celebration at the top 50th anniversary dinner party. It's like a dinner slash fireworks party and it's for someone's birthday back here. And uh, I'm excited. I don't, I don't know what to expect whatsoever. I have no idea what's going on. I'm happy to be here. She looks like a piece. My mouth. Let's go. Let's go see what's going on. I love California Grill. It's one of my favorite restaurants on Disney property, so this can't be bad. I completely forgot that they redid everything in here, and it looks absolutely fantastic. I love the monorail abstract mural. It looks really good. Wow, this is so well done. Steakhouse 71, which we've had like four reservations for and had to cancel due to emergencies every single time. But we're gonna do it sooner. What a cool thing to add for the 50th, the history of it. It's cool to see off in the distance the Grand Floridian was nothing. That's really, really cool. We're first in line to get our spoons and to get up there. I can't wait. That's fine. Good work. You didn't even hit my a little wristbands to show that we are here for the all-inclusive celebration party. Let's go. Are you excited? We have confirmation from someone who works there that the goat cheese ravioli is included. Now, I would love to do sports betting on this. Over, under, seven. How many we eat? So you're taking the over or the under? So. Over or the under? You're taking the under or the over? Okay. I'll take the under. I think we're going to do five. Appreciate it. Oh yes, I'm very familiar. <laughs> Is it the same one that's on the menu? It used to be, yes. Yes! So it's a little windy up here, so I'm sorry if you can't hear me that well, but this part over here is reserved for all the people who are doing the dessert parties. I mean, I don't dinner party. I don't even know what to call this. It's not a dessert party. The dinner party. But no one's over there. Everyone came out here, and it is cold. We came over here because it's reserved, and it actually it's a better view. It's a little further away, but I mean, this view is undeniable. Look at this. It's stunning. You know what stinks about this party is the fact that we have to watch Enchantment. <laughs> You're not wrong. Everything else is unbelievable.
Well, it is the next day after the celebration at the top party and I gotta be honest with you, it was one of the best hard ticket experiences I've ever had at Disney. The only thing I can say might be either on par or slightly better just because the experience was great was the Star Wars dessert party they used to do in Launch Bay. Uh, but you got to see the Star Wars fireworks and you guys know I'm a huge Star Wars fan so that might be a little biasy. But I'm standing by this. This is the best bang for your buck for the 50th right now. Uh, I'm gonna see what Holly thought. What did you think, Jack? It's great insight. All right, what did you think of the party? I thought it was fantastic. We haven't really talked about this yet <laughs> since since we've uh, been home, but I, I really, really thought it was great. The food was great. I like that it was light, so you actually had room for dessert after. Um, I just had champagne the whole time, but really you could have had anything you wanted, so. Yeah, they gave Grand Marnier. They had Grand Marnier as part of the open bar, which is nuts. I mean, Grand Marnier yeah. is not like, Super expensive, but it's more expensive than like the first whiskey and coke I ordered. They gave me Seagram 7 and then I asked if they had Jack Daniels and they did. But uh, it was great. And one thing I really liked about it was they kept it super small. There wasn't a ton of people there. There may have been 40 people there. No? So there was never a line to get food. It was If you want a small perfect. private dessert dinner party without the madness of the park, highly recommend. Me too. And they gave you these. I'm trying to put it against something black. One thing I have that's like black is the stove. These really cool 50th etched wine champagne flutes that say California Grill on them. They're awesome. So if you're looking for a unique way to celebrate the 50th, this is a great, great option. I loved it a lot. So thanks for watching and we'll see you guys on the next video. Till then stay safe, may the force be with you.